should we worship God in secret? Why should we hide when we worship God? The EFF says political gatherings should be unbent. And today the ANC says we agree with the, the EFF that political gatherings should be unbent because we are going for elections. He in life, who is supposed to vote? The very same people whom they stopped from worshiping God all this time. Because now elections have come, they say gatherings should be unbent. So that these people, voted. No votes for people who are against God. Today I say it. We are gonna pray for their downfall. It was a normal Sunday service when everything seemed to be going well as planned when this happened. Okay, Kevo. You have come to do Marikana here. Have you come to do Marikana here? Hey, we shall stand for our God. Have you come to do Marikana here? I wanted to destroy people who are not violent. People who are worshipping peacefully. You want to destroy people who are worshipping peacefully. Worshipping in peace. You want to destroy such people. I may the Lord fight for his people. May the Lord fight for the church in South Africa. Lord, fight for the church. Members of the Johannesburg Metro Police Department stormed the premises of Unity Fellowship Church in Soweto, in the north of Johannesburg. The reason? The church was making noise. Hear our prayers. Our crime, O oh Lord, is to pray to you. Our crime, O oh my God, is to call your name. When we call your name, they say it's noise, oh my God. When we call your name, oh Jesus, they say it's noise. They say we are making noise. When we cry to you, calling upon you to save us, calling upon you to save your people. They have left the criminals in the streets coming to church. They have left the criminals in the streets coming to church because we are praying and they call it noise they say they are responding to noise they say they are responding to noise let the prayers of the south africans reach you lord our crime is to pray to you they call it noise, lord this compelled church members to stand for their right as members of the johannesburg metro police department used force to make away with some equipment of the church. It was done in Sibuke. Today is happening here. The only thing is prayer. What we are dying for is prayer. Our sin is prayer. They say it's noise when we pray. Continue to pray. Just continue to pray. Our crime is prayer. They say your prayers are noise. So continue to pray. They say your prayers are noise. Continue to pray. Just pray. All that we can do is prayer. Just pray. Call upon the Lord. Call upon the Lord. In the process, several church members were arrested, including leader of the ministry, Pastor Mfariseni Mukuba, for contravening the Disaster Management Act, malicious damage to property, amongst others. Earlier during the service, Pastor Mukuba had questioned the promotion of Deputy Director of the JMPD, Amon Kanyaho, who she says does not deserve promotion. We cannot just talk about Ruhanyaho alone. We also have to ask his employers. 
How did he get promoted? Can't the ANC government in Zakanja? Why do women in South Africa lack protection? A woman abuser. Why? Now he is after, after women. He is abusive towards everyone who wears skirts. However, shortly after the incident, the GMPD issued a statement clarifying that around 1 p.m. there was a noise complaint at the church in Soweto and consequently deployed officers. But on arrival, the officers were surrounded by male churchgoers who thumped GMPD patrol vehicles. The statement confirmed that several church members were arrested, including Pastor Mkuba, and charged at the Moroka police station in Soweto for contravening the Disaster Management Act. As the police claimed, there were over 2,000 people attending the service.